Cano is DHing today. Oss crosses body with a tremendous play and a throw. Then he goes over and covers third in case Brandon Nimmo continues on. But Josh Harrison going into left field, throwing across his body. Trey Turner almost ran into the throw to cover second base. Watch this. Right over his head. And then Josh just keeps going to where he's supposed to be at third base. Here's Alonzo. Oh, he boy. rockets this one to deep left field. Forget that. Another home run, a monstrous shot by Alonzo. Another laser beam off the bat. And Pete is closing this season with an absolute howitzer. That's his 15th home run of the year, and that might have been the hardest hit one of all. It was the beardless Guillaume. Lined the other way by Guillaume, and he's got a base hit. That heads toward the gap. It'll go all the way back to the wall. We're almost to third. He'll be held up there. And Guillaume stands at second with a well struck double. Andrew Stevenson, 13 hits in his 11 game streak. Ah, make it a 12 game streak. And that's a gapper. Andrew Stevenson. And now he has extra base hits in eight of his last nine games with authority to left center. Ball's roasted. Yadiel Hernandez with a fly ball to left center. Plenty deep to score Andrew Stevenson. So the Trey Turner fly ball and Andrew running to third pays off. Yadiel has his sixth RBI in his 12th big league ball game. Two one game. Guillermo Heredia leads off in the second. Heredia drives one to deep left field. Stevenson takes a look and it's out of here. A long home run for Guillermo Heredia his second as a Met. And the Mets now lead it three to one. The Mets with home runs in each of the first two innings. Bottom of the second inning, Mets three, Nats one. So Seth Lugo has his hands full with a hot hitter. And the bases are jammed. Here's the 0-2. And Stevenson pulls it hard beyond Pete Alonso. He's digging for two. He's in there with another extra base hit. And the game is tied. Andrew Stevenson is amazing. And when you're hot, you're hot. You're finding all the holes. Seth Lugo now has to deal with Trey Turner. Turner rips one. And this should bring in two. Robles, Stevenson behind him. And the Nats lead five to three. 36 RBIs now for Trey Turner. Back up the middle. Two more score. So Juan Soto, five percentage points ahead of him, 346. Soto, that's going to get through for a base hit. Trey Turner heads for third. And Juan Soto just took a big step in the batting race. One for one today. Seth Lugo is going to go a, an inning and a third. Bottom of the third inning. The Mets are going to try Steven Matz now. Drew Stevenson. Fourth walk in a row, and it's seven to three. Here's Turner. Swing a fly ball left center field. This one is deep. It's way back toward the track, and it is gone. The Nationals' first grand slam of the season belongs to Trey Turner. Trey Turner, see you later. A line drive just over the left center field wall. Home run number 12. Turner has six RBIs in the ball game, and the Nationals lead it 11 to 3. John Gomes 0 for 1 with a sack fly. And maybe more. Deep left center, Jan Gomes. See you later. His fourth of the year. And it's 12 to 3. Nationals 12, and the Mets 4. We're in the top of the fifth inning. Swing and a miss. 93 away. Strikeout number four and two outs. I really commanded the glove side fastball well today. Wilson Ramos fanned in the second swinging after a single to right center in the first. And then Ramos reaching for the breaking ball. One hopper. Garcia knows he has plenty of time to set. Turns out to be a pretty solid five innings for Austin Both. Bottom of the sixth inning. And bases loaded on two more walks in this inning. Luis Garcia. And Garcia is going to bust up his offer with that drive to right center. He'll bring in two more. And it's 14 to 4. That's a feel good knock for Luis Garcia. He got a slider up, got on top of it nicely. Two more score, and the line is moving. It's a route here in D.C. on the last day of the season. 15 of the Mets five. Todd Frazier coming up. 2-2. Swing and a miss. 
And the 2020 season is all over. The Nats win seven of their last nine. They finish it off with a six and two home stand.